Welcome to Desert News on the Trail. I'm Samuel Benson, the national political correspondent. Trump did not show up to the fourth GOP primary debate at the University of Alabama on Wednesday night. His four Republican challengers chose to keep it that way, by verbally attacking one another instead of aiming their fire at the frontrunner. Chris Christie tried to Vivek Ramaswamy, Ron DeSantis slammed Nikki Haley, and Ramaswamy went after all of them. It wasn't until entering the spin room after the debate that the candidate surrogates began critiquing the former president. Donald Trump couldn't survive what these four did to him. He couldn't survive it. That's why he's not here. Ramaswamy quickly elicited boos for his personal attacks on Nikki Haley. He called her corrupt, mocked her experience, and compared her intelligence to a three-year-old. Christie eventually butted in and asked Ramaswamy to stop the insults. He has insulted Nikki Haley's basic intelligence. Not her positions, her basic intelligence. A prerequisite for participation in these debates was pledging to support the eventual nominee. I asked Ramaswamy if he'd back Haley if she wins the Republican nomination. I take that pledge about as seriously as Chris Christie or any other candidate on that stage takes it. So you won't take it seriously? Oh, I take it, I take it as seriously as the other candidates. So would you support Nikki I, Haley if I she's the nominee? The Thanks for watching Desert News on the Trail. To get more in-depth coverage of the presidential election, subscribe to On the Trail 2024 at deseret.com newsletters.